joined now by Yarn Kapilov here on the post game show. What what turned that game around because that was going all wrong and then suddenly you guys were right back in it. What made the difference? I mean, uh, we kept pushing, you know, we kept believing. Uh, we weren't as sharp as normal, but uh, you saw the second half, we just gave our fighting spirit and, and tried to get back. Uh, I think we did a good job in that, but we weren't as sharp as, as usual. Johan, if you can explain the difficulties of, of a guy and an opponent like Babelo Reynoso, while you and Marcelo are focusing on Amarillo, still trying to make sure that the lines are cut down, the spaces are closed, because he's got such a, such a fantastic left foot on him. Yeah, he, he got a good feel to, to drop in between the lines. Um, he's a good player. We knew, we knew before the game, but I mean, we have to do a better job in, in transition, and uh, I think we could have done a better job. Yeah, Johan, you, you touched on it, the slow start to the match. You know, I know there's no indication during the week that you guys are going to come out flat, come out a little bit loose, but is there anything that you could kind of put your finger on with regards to the conversation at halftime that led to such a, such a different type of performance in the second half? Yeah, we gave we, we just gave more energy. We put more energy in the game, more fighting spirit. Uh, we won more second balls. Uh, first half with the 50-50 balls, we we didn't win those, so they were dangerous with that. But second half, we just gave a little more, and, and you saw you saw the result of it. Johan, thanks for joining us here after the game. We appreciate it. Thank you, Johan Kabelhoff joining us.